So, how far are these sheep going, John? How far will you have to take them back? 150 miles. Oh yeah. And how many how many yeah. sheep did you use here for the weekend in this trailer for the opens? In this trailer, there's 120. Well, that was, well that's nice to be able to take 120 in one run. Right, we couldn't do that without the double deck trailer. Yeah. And you seem to fancy our double deck trailer. What's the difference? Yours looks like it take a lot. Ours only have 50 oh, or 60. Ram. Ram. What are you gonna get? You can get yours longer. No, uh, maybe and a little yours are longer. Wider too. This is only yeah. 60 feet wide. Over these three days, how many how many sheep dogs got run on these sheep? We ran 200 open runs and on these sheep, and we ran 285 on the other flock of sheep. Oh. So nearly 500 runs. That's a busy weekend, John. Busy weekend. Busy weekend. And so how many dogs a day is that? Uh, 66 dogs a day on this field, and 100 the first two days, and 85 the last day on the other field. The field. And what about the heat? No, did the sheep still run okay in the heat, or what? Yeah, they okay. Did, they did fine. We had shade for them both ends of the field, yeah. so they were only out of the field for six to eight minutes at a time. And what about the dogs there? It's fairly hot here. How do they manage with it? We have water tanks on the field and water tanks at the exhaust, so they can cool off. And I think they did remarkably well. Yeah, yeah. they. It looked just like home to me, yeah. even though it was hot. Yeah. No, it was a good trial. Yeah, and people are gone home happy. How far do people come from to come to this trial? We had somebody here from Florida, and we had somebody here from Oregon. So both oh, wow. coasts. They come from everywhere. Yep. This well, place, it seems like a real good central location in the U.S. Right smack in the middle. We had most of them come from under 10 hours away. Yeah. And uh, tell us a bit about this farm place. Like, you've got these big fields here. It looks like you can put on any kind of scope for trial. Double lifts, or you can do whatever you want here. That, or big music concerts. Uh, they do all kinds of stuff. And this is... Uh, I'm trying to think of the right word. It's not a preserve, but it's something like that. Like a trust or something? Like a, it's, a, it's a trust. Three Sisters Trust owns the property, and they've made it for educational events and things like that. Yeah. So and so, how long have you been running here? Or is this the first year? No, I've been involved for four years now. Yeah. It just looks like the ideal venue for trials. Plenty of yeah. park and plenty of scope. Nobody like they kind of. This be kind of our place for the whole weekend. We have yeah. it to ourselves we here. Had anybody else? Um, sandy soil, so if it rains, it doesn't matter. It drains well. Yeah. We've got good infrastructure for camping, parking. Yeah, it's just a super venue. Yeah, well, so you've got a big drive ahead of you now, leaving these back, and then your own sheep, you'll be trucking them three hours home then, probably yeah. all this week, and yep. just a lot of work John putting into this trial. I'll have about 2,500 miles of driving <laughs> by the time I get done. So for everybody else, it's a three-day weekend. For you, it's about two weeks' work. It's about two weeks. <laughs> yeah. yeah, well, it's been a good weekend. Thanks, John. Yeah.